Okay, we're back. <clears throat> I didn't want to keep recording and make that video too long, so I stopped it and then restarted it here uh, in a new recording because this is a, another new shift, uh, new patrol. This area has been rife with okay. illegal activity recently. Be prepared to show some police presence, officer. Understood. Well, she just littered, so let's go and talk to her about that. Come to me. Come to the Officer Silva here. Come to Officer Silva and let me talk to you about littering. I stopped you because I saw you littering. Is this really such a big deal? I get... Oh, smells like cannabis, really? Okay, first let me... Well, let me check you first. Your ID, please. Maybe you're not such a bad person don't have a lot sure, of convictions or anything. Here you go. Zuniga. Okay, now everything's green. Looks good, even the gun permit. Well, but she's a uh, record of verbal warning for running and stop. Convicted of robbery. Uh, convicted of child abuse, DUI, cannabis. Okay, now. So we're going to give her... We're going to give her a citation because uh, she's, she's a bad girl. I have to give you a ticket for littering, which will cost you up to $25. My lawyer will take care of it. Yeah, well, you're going to need the lawyer once I find something on you. I need to do a search on you to see if you're carrying anything illegal. Well, she might be under the limit of one ounce, so... Leave me alone! Uh oh no. <laughs> okay, Taser. Stop! Put your hands up! Well, she's running. She's going to run into cars, too. Oh, oh she did a quick... Oh, oh. Oh, oh boy, she... Stop! Put your hands in the air! What the hell is she doing? What's up with this? Stop! Put your hands in the air! I had to tase you. Just don't want to make me run all over town here. The reason why you're under arrest is because you fled from the law enforcement. Please step onto the side. Please don't do that. The vehicles are so loud. I lowered the volume to 40. Yeah. Hey. Now we gotta go find my patrol car. First we gotta search you. Oh, we did already search you. Um, we already checked her ID, so uh, we're gonna go I'm ahead taking and escort you her. Burger Haven, where is that at? Oh, there it is. Gotta stop by there and get me a burger. Uh, I, don't, I don't, I don't want to go there to pawn anything. I want them to give me money for people pawning their stuff. Okay, everybody, stop! I'm crossing the street. Got a pedestrian. Boy, look at that smoke! Yeah, you're smoking tailpipe like crazy. Hey, you got your twin sister right in front of us. <sighs> Didn't even have to take out a patrol car. <laughs> Went on foot and I caught me a suspect here. An arrestee. Uh, if you wouldn't have ran, you wouldn't have been arrested. Please stay calm and... Glitch. Didn't finish his sentence. His sentence. I didn't even see what it... Whatever. Please be calm and something or other. Alright, so here we go. Let's go back out. See what other mischief is going on out there. And as you can see, I like using the Highway Patrol paint schemes and the uniform mods. Because I am a uh, senior volunteer currently with the California Highway Patrol. And with the Los Angeles County Sheriff. I'm a volunteer on patrol. That person just littered. Well, as you can see, uh, that girl that littered uh, was, you know, it it turned out to be more. You know, she took off uh, fleeing. I had to arrest her. Uh, she was under the influence of cannabis.
Expired plates. Okay, I'd rather get the expired plate. I, I like getting vehicles that are smoking. Tell you the truth, because that's that's uh yeah. Well, I don't care too much about the turn signals right now. Tags, uh, you know, smoking pipes, all that. You know, that's whoa. Fire plates, put our lights on. Okay. okay. Yo. The reason I stopped you is because your license plate is no longer valid. Ah, I totally forgot to get a new one. Thank you for reminding me. I'll take care of it. Okay, he's pretty courteous. Let's see if he has a ID or not. and, if available, proof of insurance, please. Here you go, officer. Check the computer. Oh, this looks like a totally different person. Unless he just has a new haircut. He's okay. This is, <laughs> this guy's Asian, but the guy that I'm talking to looks white. He has a valid verbal warning, convicted of identity, identity theft, convicted of robbery. I don't know. Does this look like the same person? Nope. Okay. He's got a stolen ID. We're going to ask him to step out. Well, first, let's give him... No, let's ask I'd him like to step out I'd like you to leave first. your car he and might go to the sidewalk. Decide to flee. Flee. They don't flee in the vehicles. Uh, they flee on foot, if anything. But I don't want him to flee either way. But even if he does, you know, I'll run after him. Okay, now we'll give him the ticket. Citation for uh, expired tags. Here's the ticket for having an expired license plate. That will be between $50 and $250. I don't have that much money. Okay, now we're going to arrest him for uh, having a fake ID or stolen. I have to arrest you for carrying a stolen ID. What? And you know I'm correct because it gave me 15 points. Now we'll search him. I need to do a Make search sure on you to see if you're carrying anything illegal. Yeah, I don't want you carrying a switchblade and stabbing me with it. No, I mean, not paying attention to what you had on you. No, nope. satin glove, damp raisins, yo-yo. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and escort him. I'm escorting you to the police precinct. Your head. All right, stay calm. I'm escorting you in the car now. Okay, we gotta check his vehicle now. He's a shift driver too. That's commonly that <laughs> that sticker floats there. Okay, the stickers. <laughs> this sticker just floats in the air. It's supposed to look like it's stuck on the window. That's funny. Okay, keys. Let's check this trunk. Get it. Oh, handgun. Okay, buddy. Not good. Uh, How I you doing, officer? I don't think he had a, a, a gun for me. Okay, almost done with this search. Just trying to get points. Uh, but uh, it's just something I do anyway, you know. I don't mind taking the time to do it. I don't mind taking the time. Okay, let's go ahead and have this uh, vehicle towed, call the wreckers. I have a car here that needs towing. Please send a tow truck to my current location. The wrecker has already been dispatched to your location. Okay, they want us to transport them to Chester. So let's uh, see where Chester's at. It's up here top, so we're going to go over there. All right, and I like putting cold threes on because... Uh, People get out of my way. You have the right to a competent and independent counsel, preferably of your own choice. And if you cannot afford the services of the counsel, the government will provide you one. Do you understand these rights? And nobody answers. They never say yes or no. Okay, code three again. Let's get there. I put a code three on because I don't get penalized for it because I'm playing in the easy mode. And uh, people get out of my way. Instead of me having to go around them or wait for them. That was quick. Okay. That was quick.
like getting to Chester. It seemed like it was farther than what it really was. Okay. Let's go get our arrestee out, take him to the holding cells. It's time to take you to the police cell. Man, I still haven't earned that Dodge Charger yet. I'd really like to get a Dodge Charger out of all this. Okay, is that nobody? Okay, nobody's in the first cell. Okay, it's time for you to enter the cell. He didn't even say that. He's supposed to say it. I didn't hear anything. Glitch. Okay, be good. That person just littered. We're up. Oh, okay, litter bug, come on. You never know what you're gonna find just from litter bug. Look, they look like they're inebri inebriated. Look at her. Okay, you know I detained you because you're littering. The reason you're being detained is because I saw you littering. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to. Would you show me your ID, please? Okay, one sec. I <laughs> could. Okay, I Zach. Hey, the same girl, Matsumoto. No. I thought, oh, no record. Okay. That's a no-no. When you see this, no record of the person, that's fake ID. At first, I was getting negative points on this because I kept selecting the wrong thing. I kept s selecting, like, stolen license and all that. But I looked at a YouTube video and finally found somebody that came across this. And I saw what they selected, and they got points, and I really, okay, okay, there it is. You have to uh, arrest them for uh, fake ID. The reason why See? you're under arrest points. is because you're carrying a fake ID. Please, officer! Plus, you're under the influence of something. Please cooperate for a search well, procedure. Nothing wrong with that, though. You know, you're, you're walking. You're not driving, so... You're not a, you know, threat to anybody uh, in terms of running into them with a heavy vehicle of any kind. All right. Um, so we gave her a ticket already. We searched her. We have the cuffs on her. Let's Please proceed with me her. to the police precinct. See what, what I mean? You never know what you're going to find, even with the litter bug. They had a fake ID on them. Didn't come up on my computer. And I have another arrestee. Didn't even have to go far from the precinct either. So it just goes to show you, never know. When you say, I'm not going to stop that litter bug, that's just trash. Yeah, well, look at this. Look at all the points I got out of this. Here, say hi to your buddy in this cell next to you. He didn't say it again. This, this, uh, this uh, precinct has a glitch to it where he doesn't verbalize anything. I got to head up to Alcombe and uh, Historic Downtown to turn those things green, those bars up there. Because uh, North Point and, and the Chester are green now, so we got to... We got to... Let's check these cars out. Oh, that driver is driving suspiciously. It might be on the influence of alcohol. Okay. Let's go. Let's go get him. This will be my first... So, gotta get this one. This will be my first to get this. Tinted windows in front, too. I'd like to stop on both. Person with tinted windows and this guy. Pull over. Come on, right there. That's a good spot. Right here. There you go. Mm -hmm. Okay. Could have pulled over that curb, buddy. I mean, come on. Look at all that space there. Okay. Driving suspiciously. Let me tap the headlight. Boom. Tap it so you get your fingerprints. Okay. Oh yeah, look at them. They sure look, they sure are. 
I stopped you because you were swaying back and forth across the road. That can't be, actually. I think you've made a mistake. Please step out of your vehicle and go to the sidewalk. I love the intuition, but, or, yeah, the intuition check. At least for easy mode, it sure helps to make it a bit funner in the beginning, you know? And then once you get used to doing everything and you're, you're very comfortable and confident with uh, knowing what you're doing, then you step up your game and, and use a more uh, authentic simulation. Okay, so uh, first of all, we're going to check our ID. Let me see your ID and, if available, this vehicle's insurance, please. Sure, officer. Here you go. And immediately, I just go to the computer. I mean, I'll this okay. Her ID is expired, but I go to the computer. I don't even check her insurance because all her information's right here. You know, why switch her insurance to her ID or her license and back and forth? It's a waste of time. You know, unless you, you've never seen it before and you just want to look at it for the first time. Uh, but I go right to the computer because it tells you everything you need to know. Convicted disturbing the public peace, so she doesn't have a bad record. Just one violation there and one conviction. Her ID is expired, so we'll give her, uh, you know, I, I could give her a, vo a verbal warning for that, but still, her, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to give her a verbal warning for the ID, but have to arrest her if she's under the influence, because she was driving. If she was walking, I wouldn't uh, arrest her. Please allow me to collect a sample to see if you're under the influence of any drugs. Okay. No THC or an... an Amphetamines. Must be alcohol. Kindly cooperate as I collect the sample to see if you're drunk. Yep, there it is. 0 0.12A. Alright. So, first I can give her a verbal warning about the, uh. Oh, doesn't even show up. Okay. Show up here. For the suspicious driving. Okay. Oh, the ID. Yeah, her ID is. Ex was her ID expired? Let me see. What was it? Yeah, ID. Okay. Uh, verbal warning for the ID. I'll let you go with just a verbal warning for this one. Thanks. Yeah. But <laughs> thanks, but I still have to arrest you for being under the influence You're being of arrested alcohol. for DUI. Please don't do that. Three arrests, back to back. Man, these people. I will proceed with the search. Please cooperate. A lot going on in this town. With people uh, having infractions. Wow, you got a lot of glasses like I do. I always carry a lot of sunglasses. I'm taking you in. What? Come to my new patrol car. Oh, smoking vehicle. Those are the ones I like to stop right there. Because they're polluting the Get into the, the car, air. please. They're polluting the air. Oh, why am I getting in? Get out. Silly me. Got to check the vehicle. Wow, he goes all the way through. His body goes through the bumper and everything. He must be go through man. Ten points. Ooh, handgun wallet. I have a vehicle here for towing. Can you send a tow truck to my current location? The tow truck will be at your location shortly. Okay, so they want us to take her to Chester again, which is just around the corner from here, right? Because we just uh, we just went a little ways from here. Yeah, right there. Okay. Your shift is over. So we already oh, perfect timing. So we already yeah, have right Chester on the map. So. Any statement you make may be used for or against you in court of law. Have the right to your competent. There's a wrecker and a tow truck. You cannot afford the services. The government will provide you. Do you understand these rights? Hey there, officer. 
Hey there. Time to go to the police precinct cell. That's our, our, the CHP safety service and security. That's the CHP model right there. See that? Uh, let's see if I can get it right, right there. Safety service and security. That is an authentic model of the CHP. They didn't. That's not just pasted there uh, out of the blue from somebody who just made up something. That is the actual model. Look at that. It's three arrests. Almost back to back. See, he didn't say nothing. He's supposed to say, stay here. Blah, blah, blah. Take the cows off. You know what it is? I know what it is. I lowered the volume so much that you don't hear him say none, none of this stuff. That's what it is. All right. So let's uh, get back to our desk. We ended our shift. 20 minutes went by quickly once again. Well, there you go, people. Another uh, another day or night in another patrol. With yours truly, Officer Lopez, or the real me, Keith Silva Sr. Thank you for watching and hanging out with me here on this uh, patrol. And um, if you like the video and you enjoy it, hit the like button. And... Uh, if you want to see more further content that I post, go ahead and uh, smack that subscribe button. Okay, y'all take care of yourselves and others. Peace out, everybody.